Hello, I'm Mark Coker, one of the master black belts with Six Sigma TV.net. Today we're going to talk about the one sample t test. The one sample t test is one of the most basic tests of hypotheses used in Six Sigma. It is used to determine if there's a statistically significant difference between the mean of our sample data and our target value. However, one of the requirements is that the sample data be normally distributed. If the data is not normally distributed, there are other tests that can be used in a similar way, and we will explore those in future modules. For example, let's say we had a vendor who claims their improved process has resulted in average delivery time of 72 hours or less. We'd use the one sample t-test to determine whether or not that sample supports that hypothesis. In this example, our null hypothesis is that the average delivery time is 72 hours or less. That is to say, h sub 0, delivery time is less than or equal to 72. h sub a, delivery time is greater than 72. We'll use an alpha risk of 5% or 0.05. That means we will not accept the null hypothesis if the p-value is less than 0.05. Now let's take a look at how we do that in Sigma XL. First, in Sigma XL we would select statistical tools then one sample t-test and confidence intervals. Next, we would see a window where we would select sample data, select our, our y, our, in this case cycle time. We look at the null hypothesis where the mean is 72. We would select the alternate hypothesis, in this case greater than. Our confidence level defaults to 95%, which is another way of saying that we would accept an alpha risk of 5%. So once we fill in all those uh, boxes, we will select OK, and we will get the following output. You can see here our test information is shown the null and alternate hypothesis. Our results, we have 31 data points with a mean of 72.452. And most importantly, as we look down at the bottom, the p-value is 0.3574. So in this scenario, we can conclude that there is no statistical difference between the sample mean and the process target. Once again, I'm Mark Coker with SixSigmaTV.net. For more help with hypothesis testing, please contact us on our website at SixSigmaTV.net.